After months of uncertainty because of the coronavirus pandemic, senior high schools reopened to final year students on June 22 for them to undergo six weeks of academic work until July 31, 2020. The intention was to allow the candidates prepare for their final examination between August 3 and September 4 this year. The 2020 West Africa Senior School Certificate Examination, WASI, saw 375,737 candidates from 976 schools partake in centers throughout the country. The 2020 WASI, although successful, was characterized by some incidents of vandalism and gross insubordination. However, after several weeks, many final year students have graduated. A visit to the St. Mary's, Ebenezer and Apostle Safo School of Arts and Sciences graduates were happily moving their belongings out of the school compound. The SHS graduates were elated to have ended their three-year education cycle and for many of them, they will share fond memories of their time in school. It's finally, I'm going to meet my family and then the stress and everything. Like being in school is very stressful. So finally, it is all gone. It's all over. My friends, dining, the assembly we go, and then everything, like everything. My mistress, my teacher, yeah, yes. I'm excited because I've missed home, I've missed my siblings, I've also missed my dad. So I'm very excited to go home to meet him. I'm going to miss the morning bell. First of all, I miss the morning bell, and of course the dining. I'm going to miss the dining a lot. I think my favorite food is going to be the rice it's going to me. I really love it here. According to the Ghana Education Service and the Ghana Health Service, for schools without recorded COVID cases in at least the past two weeks, graduates can leave for their houses. In this regard, the Apostle Safu School of Arts and Sciences allowed graduates to leave after their papers. Before going home, I think that um, we had to meet all the students. Almost intermittently, um, every two weeks, we meet them and then we talk to them. But this one, they are going home. So we needed to actually meet them and then tell them what they have to actually um, take note of. Here, we have actually confined them. So we really have parents coming in to visit them according to the president's instruction. But now they are going to their own homes. They can go anywhere they want to go. But then the uh, virus has not gone completely. So, and you don't know who you are speaking to. At any time, you can be speaking to somebody who has a virus, you might not know. So you just have to protect yourself at all times. For many of the students, they are confident of passing the WASI to further the education at the tertiary level. Um, I'm, I'm confident because I know what I want. So. Yeah. Uh, okay, hey, I try my best to write what I know so I can say it's okay. I want to be at invest, um, Winneba. It's been three years in school. <laughs> And especially after the coronavirus, there were a lot of uncertainties. People were wondering, are we going to go back to school? Am I going to finish at all? Are we going to stay home for four years? All of these were concerns that were arising up and down everywhere. Meanwhile, some commercial drivers took advantage of the occasion to make some money. Uh, this is my five rounds. Yeah, my, my first drop-in is Bojasi. Uh, and I, I take another one to Apleku, that's the old Botiano side. Uh, and the third one is Pokwasi. Making me to make profit. Yeah, even yesterday I was in here. Tomorrow also I'll become here. Yeah. Many final year students who have completed their WASI are elated and they are actually confident that they will come out with flying colors. Let me also say that um, they have explained that they would not be at home idling about but would rather learn one or two skills to help their parents while they await their results. Reporting for City News, my name is Kweku Adiyama Ansan.